welcome to the last devlog of crossovers. Video is made three days before the release of crossovers. So you can see the main menu has changed. In this video, uh, I won't actually talk about that much since, but let me show you what I have so far. So let me just play as a character. Now you can see we have this new force field effect um, that happens so you don't get spawn killed. Uh, it disappears after a while and disappears even faster if you attack. You can actually see in the final game I don't have a tutorial instead I have H to show controls. Now there's two reasons why I did this instead of having a tutorial. Number one, um, I didn't have time to make a new tutorial for the new uh, way of the moveset. And also I think it's much more simpler and will take less time. Not much has changed because I've mainly been adding small stuff and balancing. So yeah, basically this video is the closest it's going to be to the initial release. So yeah, this is kind of a sneak peek of what you will see. Now there's also, let me also show you guys uh, the death animation if I fall off here. You see, every character has their own death animation on the right. And yeah, we also have music that plays if you stay in this uh, for too long. And I also have music for the map selection so let me set match time to zero and you can see we have a kind of like a mini remix kind of like a mini remix of hello my fellows which is the menu theme and yeah every map has its own song this one is a remix of happy home and robloxia Anyways, that's actually it for what the new things are to show you. There isn't really much else worth putting on the screen. So three things I would like to say. Number one, there's going to be a lot of updates to this game. Characters, patches, there's definitely going to be patches. There's definitely going to be balancing patches. Uh, maps. And also, I will also add game modes. Uh, number two, I'll actually be working on a side project while updating cross servers. It's a horror game. So just saying, uh, number three, still taking suggestions. And uh, if you have any questions, you can ask it in the Discord server or the comments. How I actually advertise this game? Well, I have a lot of Robux in stock to advertise it with the Robux, with the Ro with Roblox's advertising system. Uh, but something you can do to help advertise is to just share the game with your friends. That's all you got to do. Or you can play the game when it releases and let your friends join you so yeah uh, you can also consider liking the game uh, and uh, about progression in the game let me actually show you something let me change the amount of kills I have to zero now zero kills now why do they do this well this game will have let me show you it will have character unlocking you see you start off with all of the characters from demo one except for survivalist but he only takes one kill um zeppelin pilot takes 15 kills so you see the character unlocking process is actually really fast because i don't want to i don't want you to grind for the characters it's just kind of a small thing so uh you don't have to worry too much about the character unlocking but after you unlocked all the characters you might be wondering what else is there to unlock well, obviously, you can also unlock any of the new characters added in updates, but you can also try to get the skins. There are four alternate skins for each character. Some are harder to get than others. Here are a, Here's a sneak peek of five of the badges that are going to be in the game. Obviously, no one has got it yet. Not even the playtesters. 